Hi guys, welcome back to the Fancy Dollar. For those who are new, welcome. My name is Katie and we do all things cash stuffing on this channel. So before we get started, I do want to mention that my babes got me Venus and Floor flowers. They do last so much longer than any other brands, whether it's Roses Forever or a Million Roses. They actually last about like four or five years. So yeah, so they actually have a different fragrance than Roses Forever and Million Roses. I know they come smelling good for the first two weeks or so but their fragrance go away but these smell like real roses with a little bit of hint of floral scent so it's really good so go check them out and yeah let's get to cash counting so we have one two three hundred 400 500 600 700 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 900, I mean 1,000, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 1,100, and 1 dollars, which is correct. Let me get my money situated. Alright, so first things first, I do want to go into my Modern Budgeter Savings Challenge. She did customize this 51 envelope challenge for me because I don't like low denominations. I feel as though the low denominations take forever to save up. So I like the bigger ones. That's just my preference. So 59, so 50... 56 57 58 59 so 55 57 yep so one of my subscribers and I subscribed to her as well um she mentioned from boss of budgets she mentioned that if I would be able to do a depth confession videos I know I did them a while back but I know a lot of people didn't really like to watch them so I wanted to ask you guys if you guys would like a debt confession video from me again so just do let me know um, now we're gonna jump into my savings challenge for my personal loan and I do save up 200 every month since it's $50 a week and I add it towards my personal loan payment my minimum personal loan payment is $260 and I add the $200 on top, so it's $460 monthly. So $50, so now it has $100. Alright, so that is it for this binder. And we're going to jump into my high party bills binder. I'm only stuffing a few envelopes in here, so... Yeah, I do want to show you my thing, my layout. So I got this is cloth and paper, and this is from Sunday Magnolia. And I just add some paper clips in there, and my burgundy tassel. And I do sell um, some keychains, and you can find those keychains linked on my Instagram. So, yeah. Now we're going to jump all the way back to Easy Pass. And these are for Toes, and Toes is getting 20 so now I have 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60 dollars. And we're gonna go to Auto Care. Auto Care is getting 50. So now it has 50, 100, 50, 200, 250, 270, 275 in Auto Care. One month ahead is getting 25, so 20, 85. So now it has 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 310, and 315. Monthly subscriptions is getting 10, but in two fives. So it now it has 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So this is to pay for my Spotify and Hulu and Stars. Um, I might cancel Stars, I'm not sure, but I did snag the 99 cents 
a month from Hulu on Black Friday. On Black Friday, so let me know if you guys snagged that as well. Um, memberships is getting ten as well, but in two fives. Um, I just realized that my gym pulled out the annual fee of fifty dollars, so I do owe myself fifty. So we're gonna take care of that on my next paycheck. So now membership has 10, 20, 25, 30, 35. Okay, so that is it for this binder. And before we get to the next binder, I do want to show you guys my nails. I got these press-ons for like a dollar um, off of Sheen. And they're super cute. They're black with um, snow and some snowflakes. Cute, right? Alright, so now we're going to go into my short-term sinking funds. And medical is going to get 75. Um, I depleted my supplements binder because I needed to order more and I it didn't have enough so I did pull a couple more dollars out of medical. So now medical has 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 295, 300, 1, 2, 3. 3 of 3 in medical. medical deductible is getting ten dollars and my medical deductible for this year was five hundred dollars and then they cover ten ninety so I'll after deductible they cover ninety percent and I pay ten percent but for next year the deductible went up to twenty five hundred so after I pay twenty five hundred then they cover ten and ninety medical deductible now has ten at twenty twenty five thirty dollars I'm not sure if that's good. Is a higher deductible good? I don't know. I'm thinking it's just more money that I have to spend before they cover my bills. Copay is going to get 10 as well. And this is for like any dental vi visits. Like if I, God forbid, last time I paid like $26 only because I, I cracked my tooth when, like my back molar when I was eating crabs. <laughs> Never again. But this is to help pay for any of those you know expenses so now copay now has 10 15 20 and 25 dental is getting 10 as well and this is for my um invisalign retainers so i finished my treatment like years ago but i do buy retainers from my orthodontist it's four trays for about 700 700 bucks but each tray lasts for two to three like two years so I still have one currently um, that's in my tray and then I have two new ones still in the box. So I have a long way to go to save. So dental now has 100, 200, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. 250 in dental. And then we're going to go to emergency funds and emergency funds. C fund is getting fifty dollars, and now emergency has five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred in the bank, eight fifty, eight seventy, eight ninety, nine ten, nine thirty, nine fifty, nine seventy, nine seventy. So thirty dollars away from the one k mark, and then I'll be stopping the emergency funds at one k, and then personal savings is getting one fifty. Now personal has 4,000, 1,000, so 5,000 total, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90. So 5,890 dollars in personal savings, which is really good. Almost at 5k. And then a future baby is getting 10. And this is for like decorations for the baby showering, etc. So future baby now has 100, 20, 30, 40, 50. So 150. Wedding is getting $10. And this is for like wedding decorations. Um, my friend does wedding venues and etc. So she's gonna give me a good deal for that and my boyfriend is going to pay for the venue and stuff like that we're thinking about doing international travel um wedding 
So that now has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 20, 40, 50, 55. So 555 laid off is getting $10. And now it has 100, 150, 170, 190, 200, 10, 20, 25. 225, fingers crossed I won't get laid off, but my job security is at 100%, so we're good on that. And now we're going to go to my home binder, and my home binder is going to get just for three envelopes. So down payment is going to get $20 only. Now it has 20000 in the bank, 100, 200, 300, 400, 20, 40, 50, 55. So 20455 and I, I saw that the house rates went down quite a lot. So fingers crossed we get our home next year. Closing cost is getting $10. Now we have 1,000, 2,000, 100, 150, 160, 170, 180. So 2,180, and I'm banking on first home buyer to get the seller assistance. So we don't have to fill this much up too much. I'm worried about the down payment mostly. Earnest deposit is getting $10 as well. Now it has 100, 200, 250, 260, 270. To 80 and that is it for this binder and then we're gonna go into my travel binder and my admin is getting $26 I do pay a monthly of 105 for my timeshare so my timeshare basically I pay 105 a month for my mortgage um, for a two bedroom and two bathroom in Orlando and I get a seven night every year but if I don't plan to use that seven nights I could exchange that for two trips of six nights so 12 nights total with interval so that's how I got it um, the only way you can get this timeshare is if you come across it in Orlando which is like really rare so yeah so on my administration timeshare cost has 20 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 my boyfriend and i um go back and forth each month so i paid last month so he's gonna pay january and i pay february he pays march so etc and then we're gonna go to the islands and the islands is getting 200 dollars and now it has 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 400, 410. 410, correct. So 300, yep, yeah, 410. And then that is it for that binder. And now we're going to go into my blue binder, which is my business slash family binder. We're going to go to shipping. Shipping is getting $12. And now it has 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. 31 and shipping. Supplies is getting $60. 50. and now it has I did buy a new laminator I bought the scotch one a brand version so hopefully that lasts longer so supplies now have 50 70 and 90 100 5 10 15 so 115 and I do need to stock up on a lot of supplies because I'm about to be like sold out again and I need to order more before I have my customers like waiting which I don't want that and then parents is getting eight dollars so five six seven eight so now parents has 20 40 50 60 70 80 85 90 95 96 97 98 so 98 in parents 
and that is it for this binder and then last but not least is my favorite binder is my personal which will be getting a toe chunk as well and let's see personal is getting 30 20 and a 30 now it has 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. 45 in personal. Groceries is getting $10 only. I haven't been buying groceries since we still have some. And my parents buy groceries. We have, my parents have restaurants, so I just go there to grab some groceries. So now we have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Dining out is getting 30. And hold on, let me get this. 30, and that's all it has. Household is going to get 5. And now that's 20, 25, 30. Beauty is going to get 30 as well. And now it has 20 and 30. And here is going to get 20. And the skincare is going to get 11. And now it has 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62. And then supplements. Where's my supplement? It's going to get 20. Alright, so that is it for my side income cash stuffing. If you guys enjoyed that, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on Thursday for my December 2 paycheck budget with me. Bye!